What is going on everybody? It is me, your boy Perucho. We are back with another Dokkan All-Stars video and you know, you know how these things go. Um, I'm just gonna be talking about whatever it's on my mind, whatever I want to just like, you know, just uh, talk, whatever, whatever is, I, I don't want to say like what agenda, but whatever uh, I'm, I'm bringing onto the table, right? But obviously before we do that, the most important thing of any of my freaking videos is you guys. How are you guys doing? Hopefully you guys are doing fan freaking fantastic. I just realized too that the enemies on, you know, that we're going to be fighting again, they're slowly building up their health. So I noticed that they have like, I mean, they could have as much health bar as they want, but I think you could like adjust the, the numbers of the health bars, right? Like, so you, I, I could probably have like a boss that has like, what, maybe like eight health bars. I mean, you could do this in, in you know, like in game dev, obviously, I could probably have like a boss that had like a like a thousand health bars but like they all like to do a, a damage they just like you know it doesn't take that much it, like it just take uh oh like let's say a health bar can only probably equal to one hp so yeah that's what i was trying to say but yeah uh so it doesn't look like they're gonna they're gonna be or i'm gonna be having trouble taking them down but yeah anyways um uh i by the time this video releases actually <laughs> i did my weekly post of uh what's it called me going to the evil dead uh rise movie which was pretty good to be honest with you i definitely enjoyed myself like i like i said in the um, the weekly post um i do want to talk about it but obviously not here i think i'll talk about it maybe at a later date hopefully if i remember it did because i know for a fact i am one to forget with freaking um what's i call it just uh, just to talk about stuff and whatnot that's kind of annoying but whatever dude it's a part of me what, what could i do right and yeah um also oh actually yeah, when the time of this, my, um, the thing that I have in my eye that has been bothering me, it, it's right now, at least the time I'm re-recording, it's not too bad at all, like, it's sl it slowly went down, so, yeah, um, not bad, not bad, not bad, oh my god, I thought this guy was gonna be able to clap him in, like, one super attack, dude, freaking, uh, Gamma 2, uh, <laughs> I didn't think he was gonna launch an additional super attack, but, what I want to talk about, of, like, my movie experience is, like, the theater that I went to, dude, oh my freaking god, man, so, I actually, it's, like, Three, I guess, like three complaints of like what uh, what I want to talk about. One is um when I arrived there, um I was like looking for the bathroom, and then dude, I think there's only freaking one bathroom throughout that whole location, um like the movie theater location, and it's in the most incon. I mean, it's not inconvenient, I guess, if you're on the that floor where the bathrooms at, but there's only one bathroom. So um there's the main floor where you know you gotta scan your tickets and then you gotta go up. And then I think uh, second floor is just for whatever, just so you know, you, the stairs can, I guess, I, I don't know. But anyways, there's a second floor, um, don't know what to describe that. I guess you could just take pictures of one of what they're advertising. And then the third floor is like, there's there's the concession there. There's the the bar there, actually, I'm surprised. And then, um, yeah, they have some like some theaters there. And dude, um, I was, and then I was like, all right, the bathroom should be somewhere here, right? And then no, I actually, no, before I, uh, I, I said that to myself, there was a sign that said up uh, upstairs was like the other theaters and the restroom. And I'm like, nah, I think they're lying, dude. I feel like there's a bathroom here. And then I was like looking around that floor that like where my, my, cause my, the theater that I needed to go to, like the, sh the, sh the, um, the showroom, like the numbers, you know how they have numbers, you know, so you know what movie to go to. And you, cause you know, <laughs> the, the movies they show are specific, um, rooms. And then I'm like looking around there and I'm like, dude. There's no way there's no bathroom here, dude. I'm like, no, you gotta be effing me. Are, are you serious? And dude, I was like looking around like a madman. I'm like, oh my God, all right, don't tell me I really gotta go upstairs. And then after like looking for like five minutes, I'm like, all right, I'm asking now. And then I asked the person, and I'm like, is the bathroom really, is the only bathroom really upstairs? He, and I guess that dude, like, I don't know if he was having a, not a good time, but he gave me, he, he gave me like a, a, a I, I feel like it was like a, a smart answer. He, I, like <laughs> trying to uh tell me like he I, if i read the sign before uh, when i went up to that third floor he's like yeah and then and then like I'm like jesus all right and then, and then i'm like wow dude there's really on, only one freaking bathroom dude and i'm like oh. that's so inconvenient so because like so say like i wanted to you know maybe use the restroom during me watching evil dead right dude i literally gotta get out of the room go upstairs use the bathroom wash my hands and then run back or come running right back downstairs to the third floor and then go to the showroom and then find my seat i get dude that's that's annoying dude that, how much time would that even kill i'll probably kill a good chunk of time and dude i was a bit scared too because <laughs> when when i was watching a movie 
I did feel like a little bit that I had to go to the bathroom, but I did go beforehand too, because I went somewhere else before uh, going to the theater. But yeah, like I said, I, I did go to the bathroom beforehand, and then like yeah, and then I'm like, no, not like this, dude. I, I please don't tell me I gotta go to the bathroom. And I did have a drink in my hand, and I'm like, no, I'm not. I, I wanted to drink most of it because it was um you know I I, I bring stuff to to movie theater because uh, I don't want to drink soda. And some of the stuff in the theater can be expensive. So I brought bubble tea. <laughs> Thankfully, they didn't spill it in my bag. And then, yeah. And then, what's up, I call it? Uh, I was drinking. I'm like, no. I really, It was really good. The bubble tea was really good. But then I'm like, oh, no. I don't I don't want to drink this. And then I got to freaking, like, go to the bathroom and, like, hold it. And I'm like, oh, no, dude. I, like, I, like, I literally kind of felt it. I'm like, dude, why? Why now when I'm going to be watching freaking the, evil, um, the new Evil Dead movie? Because, yeah. And then I was just so, I was just thinking about the inconvenience of, like, you know going upstairs and <laughs> i felt like it was gonna uh, gonna cut a good, good chunk of time actually funny enough now uh, when the evil dead movie for the 2013 uh, remake uh came out dude I, I don't know how i was like really late to that movie dude like really freaking late because i probably like 20 or 30 minutes late dude like i i know i missed a good chunk of it and i think i saw that movie um twice or three times like the remake Evil Dead, and I was like, uh, yeah, uh, I, I should, uh, what's gonna call it? I should be freaking, what's gonna call it? Good. I, I don't even know what I'm saying, but uh, what? I, all, right, all right, let me restart that process. So we all, of course, what's gonna call it? We all like we. I, I said that I came to that movie late, right? Thirty minutes late, and then yeah, I came there, and then I showed, and then I uh, I saw what was happening on screen, and then I'm like, I, I pretend that was the start of the movie for whatever reason. But then, <laughs> when I rewatched the movie again, I'm like, wait, I don't remember seeing this. And I'm like, oh, that's right, dude. Freaking, I, I was freaking, I was late to that movie. I guess because I was younger. Because I think when that remake came out, I was like a teenager, so I didn't mind too much. I, but I'm pretty sure I was pissed during, during that time. But yeah. Anyways, uh, I did not. Uh, that was freaking a pain in, in the butt. Next, um, the person I was sitting next to, um, cool dude. To be honest with you, I, I don't, uh, I, I didn't mind talking to him. Like he actually, um, uh, when he came by. Like he had like I think a Resident Evil uh, hazard bag, and then uh, no what hazard bag? A Resident Evil yeah uh, I think ha uh, the hazard logo the umbrella logo there you go that's what I meant to say, and then he had like some Evil Dead patches too on his like bag and whatnot and I'm like oh that's pretty dope dude and he's like yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, what did he say um, um hail to the king and I'm like oh my god dude <laughs> there was no need to say that but sure uh, but yeah um cool dude like I said uh, that was the only time I chat with him but the one thing that I, look man. I don't know if I'm asking for too much, but please let me know. Uh, so, when show, uh, uh, I think I stood up for a second because I wanted to like stretch my legs or something, and then like you know, uh, you you shared the armrest. Uh, so I, I watched it in uh, Dolby. So like, uh, it's like usually two seats, and then like on the left and the right, there's a you know there's like a, a full armrest for uh, you know for each. To see, I don't know how to explain it, but anyways, I had to put uh, there's like a middle thing that you could like uh, bring down to you know separate between you and that other person because, like I said, it's like two seat per like I guess quote unquote couch, not really a couch, but anyways, yeah, I brought that down, and essentially, you have to share that like ar armrest with the other person, right? And dude, oh my god, dude, so I thought I'm like, all right, I, I feel like this dude, you know. Or I feel like most people would like genuinely uh, share the armrest, like you know, take half, uh, take half, and the, the other person would take the other half to use like the, to rest their arms, right? Dude, like I, I had my arm there, like for before he came, right? And then I took it off for, like I said, to stretch. And then dude, when I came back, or not when I came back, but like freaking when I went to sit down, dude, I saw like his whole freaking elbow and arm on that arm, and I'm like, dude, can you like? Give me some space so I can rest my arm. Jesus, I I couldn't even, dude. I'm like, oh my god, dude. No way. He's not. He's one of these kinds of people where they take the full arm, dude. My friend does that too, and I, I told him, I'm like, bro, you you take up the whole freaking armrest. And he, why? <laughs> that, that's kind of annoying. And I'm like, come on, just share it, dude. We're supposed to share that thing. And yeah, like. And then oh, wait, and then yeah. After that, that 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 happened, that kind of annoyed me. Um, I think this dude, yeah, he took off his arm from that arm middle armrest to I get something, get something from his backpack. And then I'm like, all right, my time to shine. I did not take up the full armrest, that's for sure, because 
I hate doing that and I don't want to do that upon other people. So I put my arm there and took half of it. And I'm like, all right, that should be enough space for him to, you know, use his arm and, or not use his arm, <laughs> rest his arm there. And, you know, uh, we'll, we'll be fine, right? And then, dude, just to, I guess, what's the, I don't know if it's petty or more so like, I I, 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 I just didn't want him to take the full arm rest again, freaking putting his own arm. Um, I, I literally left my arm there throughout the whole movie. I'm like, nope, I'm not moving my arm for a dude. Whenever I need to get something from my backpack that I brought uh, to that movie, I'm, I'm like, oh, yep, I'm gonna use my uh, my right arm and reach it to that. Yep, and my arm and my arm's still gonna be uh, staying at the armrest, dude. And then, yeah, I think I, it looked like he was a little uh, uh, a little uncomfortable, I think. But like, you have to share that thing, dude. You can't just like freaking, um, you know, hog the whole whole armrest for yourself, man. Like, come on, be be considerate, dude. Like. Like I said, I, I know I, I just ask for uh, little things. I, I guess I don't know if it's too much, but please let me know if it's any any if I should be complaining about it. Because like, dude, oh my god, it really gets on my nerves, dude. Like just half and half, you know. You're supposed to share it with the one thing that you have, right? And then yeah, that was a very like I said, that was a cool dude overall. Um, he was like laughing too throughout the evil uh, dead rise. Not not throughout the whole movie, but like you know. Just the 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 parts where it should be funny and whatnot, and then there's some, <laughs> and I think he said, um, did he? Oh my god, crap! I forgot to freaking tap the screen. Did he see something else for? Oh wait! Oh, oh my god! They literally, yeah, I remember now. At the end of the movie, did um, I don't know if you guys saw the Evil Dead uh twenty uh I think it was 30, 2013 that that movie released the remake, dude. <laughs> What's in my calling, man? So uh, at the end of that, um, the credits for that movie, uh, Ash comes out and he just looks at, uh, looks, I think he looks at the audience and he says groovy. And then dude, literally when the black screen came out or not the black screen came up, but like more so when the black screen showed, like, you know, the movie was done. Like, I think the, the first credits, you know, where it has like most of the, what's I'm gonna call it? Like the first credits, post credits, like it, it showed black for a second and he was like, oh my God, he said groovy. And I'm like, dude, oh God. <laughs> Nah, dude. Please stop. Stop. Alright, but yeah. Um. Oh, and then last. Uh, I'm like, I had three complaints. I had to. Lastly, dude. I could have sworn, in like the showrooms, there's like trash bins inside, right? That you could like throw your trash in. Or, or the like, you know, theaters just changed that up recently. Cause, dude. In the showroom I was at. Um, uh, I still had like allergies that are freaking killing me and they still are to this day like right now um, And I had to blow my nose, right? So poof poof poof, uh, poof poof blow my nose and then I'm like, all right I gotta get up and find the freaking what's gonna call it The trash bin and then I'm like wait I went to the right oh, all the way to the right of the end. I'm like, okay, it's not here Maybe probably on the left side and then no, it wasn't there and I'm like, okay It has to probably be on the side rails of like, you know when you're entering the movie you you walk like the little hallway and then you gotta like or whatever make a left or right to to see all the seats i'm like it should be there at least right and then i go there and it's not even there and i'm like dude what i have to go outside to i'm like oh god man. another another nuisance for me that something probably something minor to be honest but dude i have to get up to get any chance so i'm like all right dude this sucks because now any trash that I have, I probably have to keep it on me because I don't want to like, you know, I don't want to be that person that like, you know, have to scoot over people because, uh, you know, and Dolby, you have your, uh, what's it call it? Your recline uh, chairs or seatings. And then, you know, some people like to have it, you know, resting up and whatnot. And then I, yeah, I don't want to be there. I'm like, oh, sorry, excuse me. Excuse me. And then like, you know, just oh, dumb, dumb. they have to like lower their recline just because freaking I want to be a freaking dude that just wants to uh, throw out their trash right but yeah oh last thing too i just remember um uh dolby uh dolby uh showrooms uh recline theaters dude i know i love it when uh you know they have oh my god crap 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 oh no whatever but uh i do love how like they have an uh what's it called like things to recline like the um, your the or the shoulders i guess the shoulder part of the seat and then you, you know you could recline the the your legs and then dude so uh i like that part that's pretty dope 
Because, you know, uh, I think for the most part, theaters, when you... They have, like, their normal recline chairs, it just, like, goes throughout the whole thing, right? But, um, dude... <laughs> <laughs> those things i'm pretty sure you guys probably been to one at least i hope so um because it's a it's a good experience uh uh there'll be animals for uh, theaters but yeah uh those they have like a little um uh what's it called like a touch screen and it shows you like you know what you're gonna uh what button you're pressing to recline or whatnot right dude <laughs> so um those light up right but then once the movie starts you can't you can't see the the whole the whole like I guess touch screen I guess to freaking um you know adjust the seating and I'm like, bro, <laughs> this is always this this has always been a difficult for me because like I'm just trying to I'm squeezing a random part of the thing that I think it's gonna be pressing and then I'm like oh my god dude and then like it it kind of lights up too it's not it doesn't like light up like like the sun or whatnot but like you know it lights up a little bit I mean once you finally press it it'll light up and I'm like oh my god finally now I could see what the buns or what the buns are located at but. Uh, they're not even buttons. They're like touch screen or whatever. But yeah, that that was my last point. Like, dude, please, um, maybe have like a little light turned on. I mean, it's probably not to bother the other people, but I feel like just a small glimpse of light, just to see that what the touch controls are, would not bother anybody. At least I hope. At least they, I don't think it'll bother. Them. I mean, because you have to do that for almost every seat, though. That's the thing. Hmm. I want. I, I would like to see how that work, dude. All right. But anyways, guys. That's gonna be a mess. That's from that's it for me. And my my complaints. That's all. That's all I had. Dude. I didn't think I was gonna. Um, I, I didn't think I was gonna have too much issues during that day. But hey, um, still had, I still enjoyed watching with that rise during that day. And yeah, that's all that matters. That's gonna be guys. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I'll see you on the next one. Peace out, guys.